since there's a one minute lag time or whatever. You can say hello, hello. <coughs> We have one viewer in here. Good morning, good morning. Waiting for some other people to show up. Who, who do we have? I don't so know. Far? They haven't said anything in the chat. Maybe they just want oh, to look. Okay. But we're waiting for other people to maybe show up. I invited Hazel. Well, good. And we are going to be reviewing a little bit of last session. Yeah, just simply because I, I did some other things. I got in trouble for working on things that working on things that we were supposed to save for today. But you why know. don't you bring those out a little bit, and then we can kind of do that and wait for people to show up. And oh, well, I can talk about this other stuff that yeah, that doesn't really pertain. That doesn't pertain. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I don't. I, Mariah has to tell me if I'm in in camp. Am I on in the right yes, spot? Yes, you here? are in the right spot. That that's Excellent. the perfect spot, actually. Okay, I just want to talk about these little because this is this may be what's going to happen actually you know a lot of times I don't I just do stuff and then it becomes something I don't really have an idea of what's going to become until it actually actualizes and I was just messing around with the leftover this is my paper towel that I would the, use the when I was the dab dauber dauber for to catch the brushes when we were doing those long strips of um, oh, long strips of paper. I think it was for the journals. Oh, our accordion runs that accordion we do the sprays. Runs. You gotta yes. dab some of the super drippy stuff. Yeah. Because we put it on the line. We actually have a clothesline here in the studio. And I think really, you know, when you look at Mariah's journal, you will see some of these similar colors. <laughs> now. Some some of these have caught some other stuff, obviously, on the interim. Uh, so, whatever. And then the other thing that I used on, on these was brayer offs from the jelly plates, which I saved in this. Does that, is that plastic bag, like, really no, I think annoying? Our, I, I feel like our lighting is good today. Oh, I don't know. You can you can see that, you know, I've, I've used both of them there. And then a little, you know, spot of gold. Just to kind of and the tags things. are driving me absolutely nutty butter because I, I want them to be a little more distressed or like spray oh, with yeah. some yellow or something so it's not like just a, yeah you know, white okay. paper well you know that's one of those things that you can always do I just I, I was done with them and <laughs> yeah okay but I, I think it's kind of nice this is some of the brayer off paper that actually brayer off and spills spill catches and whatnot but you can see the brayer offs in the background there so don't uh, I, you know and i think most people are kind of savvy to that these days they don't oh we'll put that in a bag and fling it over here and i'll be looking for it like she was the last time yeah i, I found it when i was looking for something else actually <laughs> I just that's that's the way things happen and we lost Izzy's yo-yo, and all of a sudden she wanted her yo-yo, and I said, "Well, I don't really know where it is, but sweetheart, we'll find it when we were looking when we're looking for something else." And sure enough, that's exactly what happened. Okay, I have a couple of the cards that I made earlier on the last session. On the last session, and the reason I left those out here is because that's kind of where I want to go. All right, you gotta move those down a little bit, because um, right at the top of your Okay, we're right at the top. Well, I mean, you have a little bit. Okay, that's that's the colors that I want to bring in here. And you can see, you know, I have them there, but they're just a little bit bright for my in here, if you liking. Slide just a little bit oh. there. Okay. And then you have still about the paint there. Oh, 
but that's your that's your center point is right this, there. Okay. Well, that's good because that's where I've got my gel pipe. Good. <laughs> well, I've done something right here. And I mean, you can see that some of these are really, they're very close. Others need work. And then we've got Mariah uh, hooked me, and I, I really love this. I just took some of the color that I had that was kind of still on the plate and mixed it in with the yellow and smushed it on there the other day to kind of mostly did it on the edges, but just in places to get rid of the really brilliant white of the card. You can see I went around the edges there. Okay, what else did I do that was off camera? Um, okay, I went ahead, used my smaller checked. I call it like a hatch. Yeah, it's a cross hatching. It's, it's almost like a really big burlap. <laughs> it, it is. It's, it's, it's like it's burlap a, for giants. So you can see you can see the difference here in the scale, and that's one of the things I I think that you need to take into consideration when you're doing these smaller cards. They're not going to and and you. I've, I've accommodated, which I, I think was really brilliant on my part. Um, I don't mean to be tooting my own horn here, but, <laughs> <laughs> but you know, considering you, ha you have these aha moments when you're just like, oh, yes, that's exactly what needs to happen. Okay, I did some experiments last night, and I'm, I'm putting this on top of my paint so that I can remember to talk. Talk about viscosity again because we're kind of doing the opposite thing now we don't want our paint to be really 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 thick we want it to get down into the stencil and, and really these are some things that I worked on last night just on brayer offs and you can see see where the stencil was well wasn't number one. I'm try. I'm trying to get this turquoise that I have in my mind, and I'm. I'm just. I, I haven't. I haven't yet. This is very close down here. But these were the stencils that I used, and I, you know, I. I just. I. I told Mariah. I said I would really like to tell some of these people that please don't try to brayer on your gel plate when you have a bunch of mucky muck underneath it because people can't see what color you're actually using. But you can see this stencil, it is a combination of two that have been put together. Yeah, why don't you explain how that came about and like, yeah, okay. there you go. Here we go. All <laughs> right. This is the stuff that gets left on my desk and says, do you understand what I want? <laughs> Sometimes she leaves me notes. I do. And anyway, you can see that this is this was one of the cutouts from the Cricut. It was, and what I did is I just went in and I cut down the middle of the actual design. And this was leaves. Did we decide? Yeah, I leaves think it and was flowers. Yeah, because you said it was the writing. I'm like, no way, because I went back and looked at the original cut files. I'm like, there's because I was thinking about maybe using that, but then I was like, yeah, that's a lot of work. Yeah. So anyway, we've got these two pieces, which became the stencils. The thing that we're going to be using today is what came out of the middle of this. And I'm putting, I put them on the plate, and I love it because it's this Yupo paper and it sticks. I don't know what that is, but that's not needed. And um, I don't know that this is going to be exactly what we want, but anyway, I think it's going to be closer than this other one because, again, we're talking about scale, and we're talking about this little card, and we're talking about how much space that's going to take up on there. And it's going to be a lot. I want some of the other background to show through, so that's the other mitigating factor. Mitigating. Alrighty. That's the gist of it. That's the gist of it. Now we'll just move on to more specifics. And Mariah, I'm throwing these down on the floor, so you know when I You're panic ahead. because I can't find something, remind me. Then the other thing that you know I discovered this morning was my smaller brayer, which for this it's just gonna make sense because I can actually brayer on different colors here in between those strips. Hopefully. 
We don't know that. That's the plan. That's the plan. All right, now here we go. Mixing paint. And this really drives me crazy. Or it's an idea. <laughs> Hasn't been fully formed as a plan. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so viscosity. Boy, you are just staying on task this morning. You know, I mean, chuckles. I, wow. Hey, it's amazing what you can do when you had a full cup of coffee. Yeah, I think going. I was operating the other day on a. I think we only have like one tank. person watching us anyway, so it's okay. Okay. <laughs> well. You're well, doing good video stuff, Gigi. Of course I am, and there's only one person watching. When they all join in, I'll be flustered and. And I, you know, I. I just do not know what the ideal paint thing is, but I have yet to to applaud their the engineering on the tubes and paint squeezes delivery. And, well. Okay. And I told Mariah, I said, one of my least favorite things to watch in videos is people mixing paint. But we're going to be mixing some paint, people. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to make you watch it dry. <laughs> And I'm not busting out a hair dryer thing because I absolutely hate those. And please. Well, we don't have the plug in. Yeah, we, we're. I mean, we, we have a real Griswold situation over here. Yes, we do. And if we lose power, you'll know it's because our. Okay, I should be telling you the colors that I'm using, but I think you can kind of see here. Well, if you hold it out there and do my thing and, you know, wiggle it about. And... I'm holding it very still. Is it where it needs to be? I think that's pretty good. Okay. I mean, you could hold it up higher, but then it starts doing wonky things anyway. Yeah, it does. All right. So, what I've got out here, I've got. Let's just review that since I didn't. I was yakking about something else when I was going through that. We've got some cerulean. We've got some ultramarine. We've got some Prussian. And we've got a little uh, light blue. Permanent, whatever that means. This is an old tube of acrylic. They probably don't even make this anymore. I really love this color. And it looks really swell and elegant with uh, orange. Swell and, swell and elegant. I love it when you say that. Orange. Okay, so. We've got that. We're going to do a bit of mixing about. And what I'm going for here is I'm going for a dark... turquoisey tealy kind of and boy I mean that's pretty spot on I'm again firing on all jets today okay I'm liking that now I think I'm out of this is night I'm really almost out of this Mariah can we still get this stuff uh, I think so Okay, this is too small. Can you read that, please, to the oh, people? Oh, so it's the, I think it's, like, the, the brand is Art. But then I feel like there was something else after that. Yeah, they're packaging. But it's glitter ink. Yeah, okay. And the, then that's the. This is Brie Rose. Reese. Reese, yeah. Okay, Reese. Brie. And I think it's probably Brie. Uh, yeah. Here we are again with names. We're really terrible. Like, we know who the people are. We watch their videos. We just I, I are really, terrible I, at remembering names. I love these things, but the lids on them just drive me to distraction. I, I, I want to. And you think I put a lot out there, but I, I don't know what happens to this. But it kind of disappears in the mix. <laughs> I, it does. kind of interdimensional thing with glitter ink. Yeah, I, and you know, I really, I hope it's compatible. I didn't really even, I can't read Have the, you not checked this? I messed with it last night and it seemed okay. All right, I'm I, all for I, it. You know, it's kind of like those things that the, in the instructions, instructions inside the pill bottle thing that you get in packaging. Mm. Oh, yes. It's it microscopic. Yeah. Okay, I am loving that. I really, I mean... I really am. I'm going to fetch my... Do you love it? I do love it. Now, can you see? It's darker. It's more towards the one that I was telling you that I, I'm liking down here. Of course, you know, you have to remember, this is wet, so it's going to dry lighter. Um... <laughs> 
All right, now we need to add, because I want it to be more transparent. Where's my, oh, there we are. Which allows whatever is below it to show through. That's going to be kind of important here. Okay? Now, last night when I was doing this, and I, I've watched this video before, and I thought, well, I'm just going to try to find it. But it's by Marsha Volk, and it's called Viscosity Printing. Uh, it's an old video. I don't know. I can't remember how old, but, you know, it's three or four years old. It's very, very relevant, and it really explains this whole viscosity thing way better than I could ever do. So go over there and watch that. So in order to make this more transparent, we're going to whip in some gloss gel here. And I did find my um, replacement for the matte gloss gel. But here's the problem. It's no, called the matte medium. The matte medium, Just yes. The, the, the matte matte. The acrylic medium <laughs> gloss gel comes, the acrylic medium yeah. matte gel comes in the same looking little tube. You know, just change out the gloss for matte. So I thought, well, you know, whatever here, I just might use some of this. This stuff, you know, it, it's going to be similar. Well, it is, except it's fluid. And sometimes I like for it to be a little more stiff. When you're doing the stenciling, you don't want your paint liquidy and, and ushing and, and flowing underneath your stencil. And... In this case, since I'm doing it on the gel plate, it probably isn't a big deal, but I would like it to have a little more body, so I'm going with the medium gloss gel rather than the fluid acrylic. I'm sure that that makes sense to you all. Okay, so. We need we to create a chart. We do, and I. Like we sort of have it because we've done the video of some with of the, the clear yeah. with the comparison but like we need a full-on mm -hmm. like everything that they ever call any of these and check mark like when they kind of are the same thing even though they sort of call them something different because i feel like that that happens or maybe we don't know. well it's like heavy body and high viscosity you know yeah like what is Come on, people. Let's like get our turn. Get all get on the same page here. Well, all right. I'm using some of this because I'm going to be hopefully using a lot. You know, that this is going to be enough for what I'm printing today. <laughs> for all of today. For all of today. And I'm probably not going to need that again, so I'll move that over here. And I'm not whacking it while I'm brayering. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm not going to touch that one. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So. We did not lose any of our pigmentation here, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. Where, where, where are you people that can correct me on this? Well, hey, we have three people. Come on. Supposedly. Chime in there and help me out. Okay, you want to make sure that you've mixed it with the ones that, you know, is underneath there. Now, this will stay. The other day when I was making the... Yellow, remember that? Remember? That yellow was still good into the afternoon because I used, that's what I used to kind of soften up and work on edges like this right here. It was because I put the cool metal cup over it. That could be partially it, yes. Thank yes. you, Mariah. We still have that somewhere here. Yes. Okay, and I'm scooping this out a little bit because when you're doing the stenciling on, you want to do that. Now, <clears throat> I'm going to I'm going to actually try something here. I don't, I don't know that you can do this. It's, I've never seen anybody do it. I don't know why you couldn't. What are you doing? Well, instead of brayering, oh, yeah. I'm going to dab. I think um, I think Carrie did this the other day. She, did she? Well, yeah, maybe I think it, she's a dabber. Are you a dabber, Carrie? Oh, well, she's not on. I don't think she's here, but. Okay. If you watch your back, Carrie. See, I got you. <laughs> watch your videos. Okay, so here we go. I don't know how yeah, much. Yeah, you're, you're off the edge there. Am I off the edge? <laughs> Working with clear objects. 
Yeah. <laughs> Old eyes don't do very well with it. So we're also using, and I like this a lot better because I think I can control my, how much is going on there a lot better with this particular method. Method. Technique. Technique, method, whatever. Okay, I'm just going to randomly grab something here that I'm not real crazy about. Oh. Yeah, I'm not, I don't know about this blue. I, I don't know if this fits in my color scheme. Ooh, I like the print results. I'm not that crazy about she the blue. She doesn't like the blue. Wow. Hoop-de-doo. 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 Oh no. Oh no. Ah, so you should have put a bit of paint down to help hold it. Yes, I should have. I oh, should have. That was a big error on my part. Yeah. Okay, now we may have That's to. That's a rookie mistake. Yeah, well, we'll just leave that over there and let that dry a bit. I don't know. Maybe I can get some. Please note, we are not professionals. <laughs> See if we can get a little. Oh, we did a little, but not much. Because it. It is drying. Okay, now, got some. Okay, that one was there. That one was there. The reason I'm doing this is because I'd like to kind of, I, I spent a lot of time lining these up how I wanted them to be. <laughs> and we'll just put that one over there and let's see what we. Now, I think you should talk about, and maybe you did mention it and I was just not paying attention, but. Uh, what are your little strips of stenciling masking material there? I talked about that, Mariah. Did you? I did. Well, let's talk about it again. Hmm. We might have new people watching. Okay, I've got this little gel plate out here, and I don't know that I love this little gel plate. It doesn't go from top to bottom. I don't know if that's going to be oh, a the size big of your, issue. I don't think it's going to be that big of a deal. Now, what would be kind of cool... I don't know that you can do it because you got it all <laughs> glued down or stuck down. But there, there you go. I mean, you're get, I'm getting something going on there. I just don't know that I'm. But anyway, to go back to the stencils, they are cut out of Yupo paper, and it's not paper. It's really like a poly something or other is what. Yeah, it's plastic. It's plastic. But it's kind of loosey goosey plastic, you know. So you can, and that's this one is also. And they're great because we can cut them out on the Cricut. Yeah. Now, the other day I was using the... Oh, I, I don't know. Positive, negative. Is, but we're going to use the mask here. And I am going to... Um, go back to the dabber method. Go back to the dabber method here. And I want to get some of this just on edges in places. But then I want to brayer that because I, I, I can show you what I'm talking about when I say that. Okay. I, I, I like this and I kept the, um, but I just think it kind of needs maybe something else there that's not organic now the reason I'm bringing in the blue is because I think I needed the blue now I'm not sure I need on this side but I think this side needs something not going over the whole card just edges of it now see that's pretty nice Again, I, I love this side. I'm really loving this side, so I'm not going to muck it up too terribly much. Just give it a hint, you know. This yellow business here is really kind of making me crazy. Yeah, that side is, it needs some. And, of course, it's probably going to become green. Well, well, that's not too bad. Well, your stuff is dry. You shouldn't get. No, but this is transparent, remember? Oh. So I'm going to have some. show through. That's all right. I like that. It's starting to muck it up a bit and make it brown. Now, before... Get grungy. People like that. 
before I do this, I'm going to share with you just this little thing. And you know, probably everybody's out there is going, oh my God, are you kidding me? Everybody already knows that. What are you doing? Hey, it was new to me, so. We're sharing. <laughs> We're sharing. <laughs> We're sharing kind of people. Come on, Briar. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Did you grease it? <laughs> no, kid. No, I didn't. I am going to, though. I swear that drives me crazy. The reason I'm pressing really hard and trying to pull some of that stuff off, and I'm shushing it, squeezing it out into the little areas right next to it, so when I have this wonderful... Boy, I'll tell you what, it's just not pulling it like it used to. There we go. Okay, that's what I want to see. I want to see it pulling off more color and squeezing whatever is left into the crevices. I'm not going to try to take a print from that. Okay, that's simply going to be wonderful, I think. We see that our chat doesn't seem to be working, is what uh, the YouTube is telling me. I'm not sure why that is. Hmm. Okay, well that really didn't do all that much that I wanted it to, of course. Hmm. Okay. I'm not really loving that, but I'm not going to obsess about it. I did get pretty much some turquoise on everything. Maybe I will just go ahead and see. something with that. Okay, that's doing something. I don't know if that's going to be enough to matter. I don't know what's up with. Okay, now see that's crunching out that edge, that yellow edge. I like that. Okay. Let's go ahead and get this a little bit down here on the end. A little more there. There. Okay. All right. Now. What's next? Well, I'm just wondering if I'm through with my jelly plate. And we can move on to just stenciling. I don't want to get rid of it because I've got it taped down. It's going to be like a major decision. You know? <laughs> <laughs> See if there's anything else that I want to try before I get rid of it. Well, let's do this. Oh, yes. Mariah was so nice to make the stencil. And this is, this is originally... This, and here we go again, I'm talking to you and I don't have anything down there that you can see the way that's not very high contrast. See Jack, Jack, um, No, Robin said that she, what's that, the thing I did, and then I was like, oh, okay, he's telling me to. There, we can see that. Bring it back. Bring it back. Okay, well, they're solving technical problems. We'll talk about this. Hold on, tell, let them know. All right, tell them we're gonna we're gonna shut it off for just a second and come back in. So that way, hopefully, it will fix the chat issue that we're having. <laughs> 